YouTube. Uh, tonight I am going to be showing you how to flash a KV with 360 flash tool. So first thing you want to do is you need to have 360 flash tool installed and you need to have your NAND uh, on your dashboard. Um, I have a twice, I have a backup NAND right there, flash MP Duffin. <laughs> and I have it up here. Alright, so double click, 360 flash tool. And then next you're going to do is take your NAND, drag and drop it right into 360 uh, dump. Alright, now I'm going to come down to import. Select key vault. Check that. Come over to the right side. This little box with the three dots on it. Go ahead and click that. Uh, find the KV that you just purchased or had, or how you got it. Find KV underscore DECW. Alright, go ahead and open that. Alright, it shows that it's in there. Go ahead and click OK. Now it's going to ask you to save it and rename it. Make sure you save it to the dashboard. To all mine as KKK. Save. Wait for the green bar at the bottom to fully load. Okay, you're done with that. And then there's your renamed KV. Alright, now what you want to do is come up here, open file, it's right at the top hand left, click on open file, find uh, the KV that just renamed, mine is KKK, there it is, hit open, okay, now the green bar at the bottom is finished. Now what you want to do is go over here to patch. Click on patch and that little box come up. Um, don't worry about the top stuff, you never really have to mess around with that. But the bottom here, this is what you really got to pay close attention to. Click on patch key vaults. Now it's going to highlight all this as your DV, uh, DVD key. And where it's OSIG, that is the make of your DVD drive. <coughs> So what you want to do is open up the folder for your DVD, get that out, alright you want to go ahead and copy it, and paste it right here, okay now you're done with that. Now, next thing you need to do is you need to change your uh, OSIG, which is your uh, DVD brands. Uh, click that. Mine is the Philips BenQ VAD 6038-64930C. Alright. Close that. Close that. It's already highlighted, but I'll show you the get the light ons, Toshiba Samsung, it's the Ben Q's, the Hitachi's, and then unspoofed. Unspoofed is basically just um, a DVD drive with just hacks from where you know you can pretty much run anything on a probably uh, the best way to go, but I do not have that set up because uh, the guy I bought my JTAG off of is a fucking chump. And when I see him I will fucking cut his balls off. But anyways Back to this. Alright, so go ahead and select your DVD brands. Alright, and now hit OK. Alright, now it's going to ask you to save again. Make sure you save it to your desktop. And you want to save this file. It has to be this name. It's called UPD Flash. So up D flash. Make sure you spell it right. That's exactly how you want it to show. Up D flash. 
I'll go ahead and save it. Mine's going to ask me if I want to replace uh, one that already exists. I'm going to click yes. This is from our previous KV, so I'm just going to overwrite it. Wait for the green bar to load at the bottom. Okay, you're done. <coughs> now you can close that out. I'm going to open up your memory stick. Memory stick, it's got all patches, blah 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 blah, all that happy horse shit on there. All you gotta do is just take your uppy flash, drag and drop it right in there. It's gonna ask you, what loads, it's gonna ask you uh, to overwrite. Uh, I don't know why it did. That's weird. It didn't ask me to overwrite. So you're done there. Now what you want to do is just gonna close that out. Take your uh, flash drive. Go ahead and jam that into your JTAG console. <coughs> power, power up your JTAG. First time I recommend you not signing into an account that is live enabled. Sign into, you know, just a bum account. Alright, now you want to hit up bumper, up bumper, and go to your USB that has uh, Flash 360 on it. Find Flash 360. There it is, flash60.xdx. Uh, hit hit A. It's going to load up. Alright. Now, what you want to do is hit A, right up flash, uh, up D flash bin to NAN. So go ahead, hit A. And then you want to hit B, raw flash without keeping current uh, KV config. And then hit start. Start. And then raw flash without keeping current KV config A. Alright. Mine's uh, not doing it because apparently it's already, the N this NAND's already flashed. So normally you'd see some numbers at the bottom and, you know, you want to wait to get all the way to 100% and then you hit the back button three times on your control right next to the guide button. So hit back, back, back. Normally it would reset your Xbox and shut it down. At that point, what you want to do is unplug your JTAG from the back of the JTAG, not from the wall, and count 10, like Mississippi, Mississippi, 3, Mississippi, do it like that. Don't just go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 10. So once you get 10, uh, go ahead and plug it back in and press the power button. And if you get all green lights uh, on the front, you uh, son of a bitch because you did not get a bad flash. If you get some uh, Christmas lights, then you might want to hunt down the guy you bought the uh, KV off of. Alright, and then you would just, you know, boot up whatever game you want to play normally. I'm going to boot up MW2. Uh, H1, counter, MW2. 
two. I already got a patch in there, so I'm not going to paste one in. Go to the default MP and Uh, and then go on Xbox Live, I can't, because this KV is banned, so I'm just going to the system works. Create a game. Game set up. Start game. And, right now you should, you should be online. Like I said, I'm not, because this is a bad KV. Obviously I used it last night, so. Yeah. I have no idea what patch this is. Obviously a shitty one. Interesting patch, I don't know what the hell this is. It's not true. Basically just got my email and <laughs> saying it's a temp lab. Oh, you know what this was? This is my first patch I've ever made. That's what it was. I had no idea what I was doing. Just kind of messing around. But, it works, regardless. Alright guys, peace. Make sure to subscribe and uh, make it hit the thumbs up twice. Thanks.